You know, I've been bedridden for the past three weeks, going on four weeks. I've felt like hell, too. I've never been this weak. I don't know what's wrong with me. To me, uh, it's just like, uh, I feel like I have polio or something. I'm not sure what I've got, but uh, the doctor I saw, he's a podiatrist. Well, let's talk about the condition. Uh, I've got a slight, a very slight case of athlete's feet. It's right in here. I can kind of see it. It's funny when I touch it, I really don't feel anything. Uh, and it doesn't hurt, but something about having this is just, just knocks me out of my socks, pardon the pun. <laughs> Shoes and socks and feet. <laughs> anyway, getting back to what I've been through, the podiatrist took a look at me. He said, well, Ted, you look good. You know, you look healthy. You look just like the average Joe. But the thing is, he says, he took a look at the big toe there. He says, this is the worst case of a very slight case of athlete's feet that I've ever seen, quote unquote. That's what he told me. And when he said that, I got weak in the knees and I actually passed out in the office. Scared the hell out of me. I've never had this before. I can't see it either, but he said it's definitely right here. And all the other toes, I'll show you the other foot. Uh, they're okay, there's no cracks or nothing. I don't notice anything there, but this one, yeah, I, I, uh, I've never been up against anything quite like this. In fact, I'm getting weak right now thinking about it. Let me just get the, the blood back up to the head. Yeah, and everyone who sees me, they say, Ted, where you been? You look fine. I said, well, I've had a case, of this, a very slight case of athlete's feet, and I just stayed in flat on my back, trying to rest up for this thing. Doesn't seem to be going away either. But they all tell me I look just fine. I look better than the average Joe on the street. Yeah, and I got one of those comparisons to the young Tony Curtis also just yesterday when I went down the hallway to take a leak. <laughs> well, anyway, I better rest. I've overstressed myself just talking to you. So I'm going to turn out the lights in a minute and uh, I hope to see you soon. I'll try and get back to work as soon as I can when I beat this thing.